technology offers numerous benefits in terms of efficiency and speed, but it also has the potential to expose organisations to risk. Jonathan Gibson spoke to the SciXL team to see how they provide companies with a robust 360 solution. In the fast-moving digital landscape, the threats facing business are constantly evolving. From emails to e-commerce, we all now inhabit cyberspace. But that interaction is one that puts us and the organisations we do business with at risk from the cyber criminal. Edward Lewis helps businesses develop a strong risk culture and prepare for a cyber attack. He leads a multidisciplinary team called SciXL, which supports businesses every step of the way. If you look at today's cyber services market, you'll find that there's a vast patchwork of tools and services on offer. But for many business leaders, that's extremely confusing. So we brought together SciXL to try and give a globally focused solution that was simple and could be deployed in multiple jurisdictions. SciXL was created by Wakemans and its partners to help businesses anticipate and manage cyber risk using a six-step plan to improve resilience. So ladies and gentlemen, thank you all for convening. We are now hours into this incident for our client, a major retailer with premises in North America, mainland Europe, Asia Pacific and Australia. When a cyber incident occurs, managing the response is both time and skill critical. And SciXL brings together a team of experienced professionals with the skills needed to deal with the immediate impact, as well as supporting their clients through the longer term consequences, like reputational damage and claims for compensation. SciXL gives you that team. Those relationships are already in place. You've got a range of experts that are used to working together. That's the beauty of our product. Cyber resilience for me is all about uh, allowing the business to continue to operate in a, in a crisis scenario. But it's not just about keeping the bad guys out. We need to make sure that IT is working uh, you know, at all times. So resilience, con the consideration of resilience should also uh, you know, deal with those issues as well. Understanding where the business is today, where it wants to get to tomorrow, and how much of that um, is dependent on and will leverage technology and data. You can start to build a business focused cybersecurity strategy that will be uh, an enabler for your business and not just a cost centre. SciXL also works very closely with insurers and brokers, actively encouraging more companies to consider cyber insurance as a key component of their wider cyber resilience planning. Cyber insurance provides you the funding in order to deal with any sort of um, response strategy that you may have already planned for and implemented, but ultimately you need that specialist team. You've got uh, large organised crime groups, you've got state-sponsored uh, attacks, and um, it, the, the industry, the cyber crime industry, is, you know, is huge. It's a staggering £1.2 trillion uh, worth of revenue is estimated uh, from cyber crime this year alone. Businesses who suffer a cyber attack can also face hefty fines and claims from data subjects, encouraging employee vigilance and making networks as secure as possible helps to mitigate that risk. What we can do here, however, is stick in some malicious code. And this malicious code's job is to steal the cookie. Tom Kranz from 6.6 .6 is another supplier of SciXL. He's showing me just how easy it can be for criminals to hack into some networks. Every person who accesses that page will have their login credentials, their cookie stolen, and an attacker can then use it. It's as simple as that. And another reason why a cyber resilient strategy is vital for business. Helping corporations to fend off cyber attacks and dealing quickly and effectively with those that get through. We are able to put an arm around the shoulder of the exec board, of the leaders of an organisation and to deliver for them. Peace of mind that we'll be able to withstand most of the attacks. But for those that we can't, we'll be able to respond to them and get back on our feet quickly and with least consequences.